In this video, I'm going to talk about how to place buy and sell orders on World Simple Trade for Canadian Depository Receipts, also known as CDRs. Recently, I made a video on CDR. You may find the link up here on the description box below. Hello, my name is David Das. In this channel, I talk about building wealth and income from the stock market. Before we start, please read the disclaimer. This video is for educational purposes only. I'm not a financial advisor. Please do your own research before investing. We will cover both the desktop version and the app version of World Simple Trade in this video. Let's jump on the World Simple Trade desktop version. So we are logging in. Enter your email ID and password. They have two options here, invest and save, trade and crypto. We will do the trade and crypto. It gave me two options, whether I want to be in the personal account or the TFS account. So I selected the personal account. So this is the balance I have today. The mar market is currently open. And let's say, for example, we are planning to buy PayPal CDR. So let's type in PYPL. We have two options here. One is the NASDAQ version and one is the, the CDR version. So we will pick CDR. This is the information of PayPal CDR. Currently the price is at $15.14 Canadian. We are looking at a one day chart. The market is currently open. If I go to one week chart, this is how it looks like. One month chart, three months chart, three months chart, and a one year chart. Keep in mind that these CDRs were introduced in Canada in the summer of 2021. So maximum data we have is for about six months. If we scroll down, it has the market details of the stock and the company information. So let's look at the right side of the screen here right now. I have a personal account of $6,228. This is the order type. Let's say we want to place a limit order, which I always prefer. And the highest price I want to pay is say for example $15.10. So I type in $15.10 and I want to buy 400 shares. So estimated cost will be $6,040 Canadian dollars. And I press the buy PayPal button. So this is the information about the limit buy order. How does it work? I continue. One important thing is it's better to check this box here. If I want to keep my order open until it's filled for a maximum of 90 days that World Simple allows. So that means if the price do not come down to 1510 today, the order will still remain open tomorrow and up to 90 days from now. Confirm order. The order is sent. So right now I want to see if my order has been filled. So I went to activity and I picked my personal account and I am looking at activity types for buys. And right now the order is pending. That means the price has not come down to $15.10 yet. It will expire until I cancel it. And the limit price that I gave was $15.10. Say I want to cancel this order. I said yes, and the order is canceling. So I go back to my Wealth Simple Trade screen, and I have the information for PayPal CDR. Keep in mind that these CDRs are only meant for Canadians at the moment. U.S. citizens cannot buy or sell CDRs. The price of PayPal CDR is now at $15.15 and let's put a limit order and I'm going to pay $15.15 max for this and I want to buy 400 shares 
estimated cost would be 60 60 that means six thousand and sixty dollars and I place the buy order this is the information about how the limit order works continue I want to keep this order open for next 90 days if it is not filled check confirm order and the order has been sent and it says order has been filled as well that's great news right now the objective is to sell the PayPal CDR so I go to my personal account and you can see I have 400 shares and I want to sell it so I will say sell I want to sell at a limit price and I want to sell it for $15.15 .15, 400 shares and I press sell PayPal this is the information about the limit orders and I say continue same thing I will keep it open for 90 days confirm order and it is done so that's how you place a buy and sell order on one simple trade on the desktop version now I'm going to show you how to place buy and sell orders on one simple trade app I have screenshots from my phone and I'm going to play them for you now That's pretty much it for this video. I hope it was useful. Thank you for watching and I will see you next time.